Tracy Stetter and I spent an entire day at Draper Labs, which is just outside of Boston, learning about a new endoscope that uses microelectrical mechanical mirrors to look deep inside the body and find cancer. While we were there, John Bernstein, who's one of the lead researchers at Draper, took us into the lab where the mirrors are made. So we're going to the clean room. Yep, there are. The name is pretty indicative of what it is. It's a room that's super clean. So can you tell me a little bit about the preparations for the clean room and what's involved? Um, well, what is a clean room? Clean it's room. a room <laughs> where you have um, HEPA air filters. They're taking all the air and running it through filters to remove all the little particles that are normally in the air. Mm -hmm. And uh, once you've done that, the biggest source of particles is people because we're constantly shedding particles from our hair and skin and, and clothing. Before going into the clean room, we had to suit up. This is the first time that I'll be wearing a veil. So we have to wear these uh, plastic gowns that completely cover us from head to toe. They're called bunny suits, these big white um, outfits. Yeah, <laughs> And uh, that's to keep the, the product clean, because one particle landing on your device could kill it. So Tracy, John, and I changed into booties, hats, and facial masks, as well as those full body jumpsuits, basically covering our entire body. It's a bit of a process to go into a clean room. It took all three of us about 20 minutes or so to get ready. So when you go into the clean room, how long can you stay in there? Uh, it really depends on how much coffee you've been drinking. So, you know, it's always good to go to the bathroom right before you go into the clean room so you don't have the urge to run out because there's no bathrooms in the clean room. You have to take off all your gown and bunny suit and, and go out and yeah. come back in. So it really wastes a lot of time. For Discovery News, I'm Casey D. Gardner.